Hello, everybody, and welcome back to the Classical Pairings Weekly Host Challenge. Every week, Classical Music Indie has been sending me a piece of local music and a local spirit, and I'm pairing a cocktail together. This week, we're going to be taking Hotel Tango's bourbon, and we're going to be making homemade bourbon cream. I'm going to be giving you my secret recipe that I came up with, uh, so use it wisely. We're going to be mixing this with a piece of music by Jared Thompson. The work is called Affirmation on the album Vices, performed by Premium Blend, all local musicians that you can hear now on Spotify. So let's go ahead and dive in. First, we're going to look at the ingredients that we need to make homemade bourbon cream. homemade bourbon cream, we're going to be using more ingredients than we've used uh, any week so far, uh, but I'm not going to tell you that this is a healthy thing to make, um, but I will say this is probably the most delicious thing I've ever created, and I decided I might as well go ahead and let you all know how I do this. So we're actually going to need a blender for this, um, and we're going to need lots and lots of ingredients that we have here and that you've seen on your screen. We're going to start um, with some heavy whipping cream. I use one uh, carton for this. So by the way, my goal, while I'm putting this together, I'll explain, I wanted to do something that was kind of like Bailey's. I started doing this a few years ago, but as opposed to Bailey's, which uses Irish whiskey, I wanted to use bourbon. I also wanted something that had a little bit more freshness to it, a little bit more creaminess than something like a Bailey's. And so I came up with this recipe for homemade bourbon cream that you can also do all sorts of different variants with. Um, I've made it using pumpkin. I've made it using lots and lots of chocolate. I've, I've done a few different ways. Um, I've given this as gift many times. Heavy whipping cream is in there. We're now putting in a can of sweetened condensed milk. Again, not the healthiest thing we're going to be making, but you don't you're not going to be using this in large quantities. Uh, this will store in your fridge uh, for quite a while, although... I'll confess that whenever we have it, it doesn't last that long. We get through it pretty quickly. So, sweetened condensed milk. There we go. I'm getting most of that out. If I wasn't taping a podcast, I might be more thorough here, but we don't really have time for that. So, one can of that. We're now going to do two cups of bourbon. Hotel Tango's bourbon uh, works very well with these sorts of... Um, uh, Hotel Tango's bourbon works really well with cocktails and with this sort of blend because it's a high proof bourbon. Uh, so this is a 90 proof as opposed to an 80. And it has a nice smooth flavor that's going to blend very well. And so I'm actually going to put in a cup of bourbon here. There we go. Sometimes I make double batches of this and we'll end up using two cups of bourbon. But for today, there's our cup of bourbon. Okay, we're gonna keep this close because we're actually going to be mixing this bourbon cream with bourbon later, uh, because why not just have more of a good thing? Uh, we're next gonna put in a tablespoon of instant coffee, which is going to give it um, kind of a warmer uh, flavor to it. You wouldn't necessarily have to put this in, but I've tried making it without and I was kind of disappointed with the results. And it doesn't have to necessarily be a good instant coffee. But I like that taste and that sort of burnt aroma that you get from it. We're next going to put in a teaspoon of vanilla extract. Or maybe just a tiny bit more than a teaspoon, but that's all right. And then we're gonna put in, we're almost ready here. We're gonna put in two tablespoons of chocolate syrup. <laughs> One more time, not the healthiest thing, but you're going to be drinking this in small doses, putting it in your coffee, uh, that sort of thing. Things you would do with Baileys. You would not normally just sit down and drink a whole bunch of, you know, a big glass of Baileys, uh, that kind of thing. So, there we go. That was two tablespoons of chocolate syrup. That is now actually everything. So now we're going to blend all of this together and we will have our homemade bourbon cream. All right, so I'll be right back after I give this a quick blend. 
Okay, I have given this a blend. It is all ready to go. You will see that it's uh, a very beautiful substance. Now, I, uh, again, I tend to, when I have this, I tend to put it in coffee. That's like the main thing that I actually use it for in the morning and it's uh, delicious. Uh, but you can also uh, do a, uh, some different drinks with it. And we're just going to do bourbon cream and bourbon. Mix two great things together and you end up with a fantastic drink. Uh, so I'm gonna just do a shot of both of these actually. So one ounce of the homemade bourbon cream and you just do this on ice. There you see. Hmm. And then one ounce of bourbon. So I, I tend to really enjoy kind of creamy, thick cocktails, which is what we're having here. So we're just gonna give this a good stir. Uh, it's gonna take a little bit of stirring because the, the, the drink is kind of thick. Um, but if you like creamy cocktails, like White Russians or mudslides or anything like that, I think you are definitely going to enjoy this one. Um, it's sweet, it's rich, it's chocolatey, it's bourbony. It's pretty much all the good things in life. Now that you have your drink, let's talk a little bit about this piece of music, Affirmation by Jared Thompson. So Jared Thompson's a local saxophonist um, and a band leader with Premium Blend. He is also a composer, and he writes a lot of the songs for Premium Blend, though several of the musicians work um, composing within that group. Um, this song is on their most recent album, came out last year. It's called Vices. You can listen to the whole album now on Spotify, and it's really fantastic. Affirmation, the track I chose for this is the second to last track on the album. I thought that um, in this piece, there was, I mean, it's, it's, I wanted something to mix with this that was sort of smooth and rich kind of sounds like a, like a relaxing Sunday morning. And what I like about this piece um, and a lot of Jared's work is this sort of blending of the sort of modern style of jazz composition with hard bop style of the 50s and 60s. My first love in music was actually, I'm, I'm a jazz saxophonist as well, though nowhere near as good as, as Jared is. But the, to me, there's something in this piece of music and a lot of his playing that reminds me of kind of early 60s John Coltrane, that, kind of, that's, that era between Giant Steps and A Love Supreme, uh, when Coltrane's starting to expand his harmonic and musical vocabulary even farther towards the direction of free jazz, but still rooted deeply in the hard bop sound of the 1950s, something that you might associate maybe with Sonny Rollins. And so I hear that in this piece, and to me it is something that's very comforting, very beautiful, but also just enough of an edge and some interesting harmonic uh, explorations. And in this piece, a really kind of fascinating ostinato that are a, a repeating musical idea that kind of a, uh, just keeps happening that's kind of a bed over which the improvisations happen on. Um, and I thought that it paired well with this drink again because, like immediately because it's smooth, it's very sort of luxurious, it's kind of a treating yourself sort of drink. Um, like I feel like this out, this this out affirmation, I mean even the title gives us that. But then I think there's this sort of more mature undercurrent of a sort of inspiring and kind of dramatic type of, of, of writing that in this drink, I think, comes in with the bourbon. You'll hear it in the solos and the music, and I think the bourbon kind of shines to give this maturity and this depth into what is otherwise a very sort of just comfortable and calm composition. So let's go ahead and give this a listen. This is Affirmation by Premium Blend. Cheers.
I hope you've enjoyed Affirmation by Jared Thompson, performed by Premium Blend. Go check out the rest of that track and the whole album Vices on Spotify now. Also, I'm certainly enjoying Hotel Tango's bourbon with a homemade bourbon cream. You've got to give this a try. You've got to make it. It's, um, it's one of the best things I've ever created, and I'm happy to share it with you. So come back every Friday. We're going to keep pairing local music with a local spirit, and stay tuned. We're going to have some exciting news soon about season two of Classical Pairings. So I'm Nick Johnson. Thank you so much for watching from Classical Music Indie. Cheers.